Hello everyone, today is Monday, October 21st. It's about 5.35 p.m. Eastern Time. And we have another live trading video from Jim. So uh, this is our website. If you need to get in touch with us, uh, here is my contact information. And of course the website is bluewavetrading.com. So I just wanted to bring over my five minute chart of the NASDAQ that I've been showing and uh, kind of show some of the levels Jim's been talking at. And as you know, I, these blue lines of support resistance or high volume nodes uh, have been drawn on the chart for quite some time. And many of these are still in play. Uh, really interesting how this plays out. You know, I, these are not drawn after the fact, but a few days ago I drew uh, this high volume node here and this one here probably from this this line here which uh, caught resistance here and then this line caught support this was the low of the night session or near the low and this was the low of the day session here this area here and I think it was this high volume node Jim talked about 7944 and that is this high volume node from the night session and I drew that um, actually the line is beginning here so I drew it on the 17th and you can see how this uh, was resistance here and just at the very end of the session it popped above it a little bit anyway uh, great video from Jim today showing uh, exercising uh, not only patience but discretion on uh, whether to continue the trade or not uh, so let's see what happened uh, today October 21st, I do have to leave in about 20 minutes, just trying to take a look at the market overnight. Uh, so definitely we are in a range bound kind of a market uh, that is below 79.16. Anything below 79.16 is uh, bearish and could target 78.60 above 79.16 anywhere from 35 to 44 and then to 54. Uh, so I still have some time left just to see if uh, they can kind of make up their minds. The template I'm going to leave uh, running would really depend if, if that 79.16 is uh, conquered, so to speak, or uh, they're failing below it. If, if they're above it when I'm about to leave, I'll just uh, click on longs only and if they, if they are below it, uh, it will be shorts only. All right, so I am back a little before 11 o'clock looking at this template from the morning. So this looks like I got some uh, bad slippage, but the uh, trades worked out. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Mm, where are we? Here we are. Okay. Oh, so that happened pretty quickly. Look at this. Looks like we got in at uh, 9.35. And we were done by 9.36. So this was a quick move up 
for whatever reason. So this template, this template uh, has the step MA with option one. Yeah, step MA with option one. Now what that means is not only must price be above the step MA line, step MA itself must be, must have a positive slope. So for example, if you would ask, you know, why didn't this trade qualify? Well, price indeed is above the step MA line and the bars are blue, but the step MA is flat. Since the step MA is flat, this template is not going to take a long trade, which of course was a good thing because it would have stopped out. Uh, but in this case, we have sloping step MA, sloping up with blue bars, and then the other trader takes a long. First target, second target, looks like within a minute here. This was done within a minute. Just uh, some bad slippage, that's all. Okay, so at this point, let me... Right, so I'm just looking at a higher time frame on a different monitor here. Trading above 79.16. Should have brought us to 79.44, but we stopped at 35. And then started to trade below 79.16, which should have brought us to 78.60, but we stopped at 85. So definitely this is a market in indecision. Could not quite reach the higher target and could not, not weak enough to trade to the lower target. So, based on this, I can say I am very cautiously bullish, but I am aware that we are in a range. Here is what I know at this point. Today, we are either going to hit 79.44 or 78.60. Now, in reality, we could do both, but the question is which one would happen first? And based on what I see, 79.44 should get hit before 78.60 is hit. So I'm going to put the recording on pause, load up another account, and uh, just choose the appropriate template for this kind of a trade today in the trade. All right, so here is the long. Um, looking for 44. I think um, they should not have an issue hitting 44 and then higher to 54, maybe possibly even 67. All right, so just hit uh, first target. By the way, I think I forgot to mention this uh, template is actually three contracts trading. Three contracts, uh, 30, 50, and 80 ticks with a target of um, um, 850. I kept the stop still at 500. This way, if I'm, if I'm wrong, then um, there's no reason to take larger losses than necessary. I think we should be able to reach these numbers. Very slow day. It's uh, slowly kind of grinding higher, but I'm going to go out for a few minutes. I'm going to leave things running here. I think 44 is in the cards. Past that, uh, it's just really slow, so we'll see. Right, things are painfully slow. I mean, during a regular day, there should be no issue. During regular volatility, getting to 44 should be just a piece of cake. This is obviously not an average day. I'm going to close this position here. I don't know. I, ju I just don't like how this is going. Obviously, um, so far, uh, I will not reach my target for today of 850. I still have one. Contract going, I'm going to lower the target. Uh, mm. Going to lower my target and um, just hope it will come, come to this target eventually. A very painfully slow day. And those days will happen and we have no control over it. Also, I put my stop at break even. They take me out. I will be done for today. As you could, as you can see, I unclicked 
shorts. Uh, so if I'm taking out at break even, that's it for today. Hopefully, price is going to try and come up to this uh, 44 area. And I know, well, um, it is what it is. Okay, gonna go further and uh, raise up to 50%. Uh, I guess uh, resigning myself to the fact that this day is just not gonna go anywhere. And I don't wanna be stuck here if it's not gonna go anywhere. Well, they put me out of my misery. <laughs> uh, Got stopped out here on the uh, trail, and you know what? Thank goodness I couldn't possibly keep sitting here. Very slow day, not exciting at all, but uh, not every day is going to be exciting. Okay, then uh, see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully it's uh, there's a bit more volatility.